Well, drink handover is done to Andy McCarthy and Myron Bell here. Andy, the strategy here, you get the front. Nobody's going to catch you at 53 and 2 home. Right, yeah, I, um, I wanted to get around Yannick early, you know what I mean? So then I kind of had the, the cards in my hand. Um, you know, I let Timmy go and thought I'll get back there and kind of just keep an even pace and um, didn't really want to invite anyone to come. And uh, I got to slow the third quarter down a touch, which worked out good, and she uh, d dashed on. She's been pretty good all year, told Rick Hanover, 10 for 18 lifetime. Yeah, she's a great mare, you know. Uh, we had a little bad luck earlier in the year with uh, post positions and whatnot, but um, I think she's the best filly in the country, and I think she, uh, she'll finish it off. High old discretion, Caviar Alley coming up. Yeah, very, very exciting. exciting. Excited about the Hambo? Yeah, I love it. And, uh, you know, I've never actually had a drive in the Hambo final, so hopefully we're getting through and uh, and have a little luck. Beautiful. Myron Bell, what's going on with you? Marvin Katz. I'd like to say hello to Marvin, who's in Canada, and I want to say hello and wave to him. And congratulations. A great partner and a great man. And we're very fortunate to have a filly that Tony and I selected at the sales. And Hanover Bratter, they deserve credit. She's from a great maternal family delinquent account who's dear to us by his first crop sire, Captain Treacherous. Yep, the captain's having a big day. Congratulations. Thank you very much.